This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics. We're selling this 2000 Dodge Ram 1500 regular cab on eBay. It was a theft recovery. It's on a clean title. Four wheel drive with a 5.9 liter. It's SLT. The paint was really faded and rough so we just painted the truck we did no body work whatsoever there's a couple dings in it that were painted over uh, door dings type of thing it's a Mako paint job uh, we paid 650 for it um, so you can kind of get an idea of the quality it's it's actually pretty good um, it is a one stage paint so you know it's not the same as a new paint job but for a 10 year old truck it's got 97,000 miles, it looks pretty good. There's the tires. There's a little bit of stuff right here. I don't know what happened there when they painted it. There's a little scuff there. Come the hood here. Under the hood. You can see the fenders are all original. They just painted right up to this line, so this is the former paint. That's kind of what the car truck looked like. Kind of faded and peeled paint. Um, there's your core support. Everything's nice and straight. The stickers are where they're supposed to be. Fenders are alright. Just a couple little you can even see them in the video. Maybe you can. Just kind of little dings and stuff that trucks get that you just paint it right over. Oh, there is a little ding in the bumper. This is the re only real ding slash dent that there is. There's a little ding here, a couple on the sides. Nothing real big. There's a little tiny ding right here on the driver door. Anyway, the interior looks pretty good. Someone's run a couple of screws through here that obviously if a black screw would make it go away. Seats look great. Um, oh, I forgot to show you the tire. This is the rear tire. Looks to me like you could probably drive it home, but front tires look fine. The rear tires look like they've got maybe a couple thousand miles left in them. Turn that radio off. Oh, the dash mat is hiding that. Got a little crack in the dash. Very, very normal for Dodge trucks. These are real hard plastic. Passenger seat looks good. Actually, it looks great. The seats look great. Carpet looks really good. Um, four by four. Let's see. Put it neutral first. There it goes into, that was pretty easy. Four-wheel drive, right there. Let's put it back in neutral. Now bring it back to four high, and there's four high. There's overdrive. Overdrive is on. Put it back into. There we go. Okay. So, we have 97,000 miles, gauges look good, let me take you for a little quick ride down the street and we'll be done. I'm going to put it in park if I want to do that, don't I? I mean, put it in drive if I want to actually... Beautiful day today. About a five degree, five mile an hour wind. It's about 75. Yeah, it's just too good right now. Anyway. Wow. This thing runs great. Really good. Um, 
I would drive this cross country in a second. Drives and shifts perfectly. Let me turn this thing around. Four wheel drive works. The air is blown ice cold. Radio works. Windows and locks work. Power mirrors work. Let me show you the air real quick here. There you can hear the air going. The windows are up and it's nice and cold in here. Alright, let's do this one more time. Really smooth ride. Feels like it could use a little bit of an alignment. Just a little bit. Kinda wants to go a little bit left, which all cars do. But uh, nice truck. See it on eBay, thanks.